interesting thing though, it's only two centimeters of stack in the rear foot, only half a centimeter drop. These things are flat to the ground. I mean, you know, it, for the name Protro, it definitely is new tooling, but kind of what we're used to seeing with a lot of, you know, Nike basketball right now, where you got Cushlon 3.0 as the main carrier, then Zoom Strobel on the top. It is, it, it kind of just has the, it's like that indented Zoom Strobel, so it makes it just more fluid to bend. You make 62 Newtons to get it to 45 degrees, and it, that's nothing to do with the carbon fiber shank in the middle here. It's all to do with how thick the rubber is and just how much casing there is. And so you can see it does bend appropriately. That's fantastic. Portional stability is just out of this world. Um, that is the, the casing of the rubber to me, especially here on the lateral flange here. About 43 centimeters in the rear foot, 40 in the forefoot. Yeah, I mean, this shoe does feel pretty springy, you know, especially on your forefoot. But all in all, you know, by, by today's standards, it's pretty basic midsole setup, but for what it is and for what people would want, a little lower to the ground, lower stack shoe, but also in a higher collar once again, it would fit the bill for those people.